Good morning, YouTubers. Well, just woke up to this, and I'm about to try my new used snowblower. We're probably talking probably an inch here, a little over an inch. So this is a good time to try it. I've been waiting to uh, use it, but we haven't had any real snow, so this is not a whole lot of snow. So let's uh, put it together and see what see what it does. All right, so this is the 21 inch 15 amp electric snow thrower, they call it. It's a uh, snow joe, is it? I think, I think that's what they call it. I got this on Marketplace for $50. Yeah. Here's the old snow joe. So, this is like brand new. It's got a light. And only. Oh, yeah. Looks like it's only been used maybe once or twice. The guy sold it for 50 bucks, so I said, okay, we'll give it a shot. But I've been, I've been wanting to try it, so let me get the extension cord and we'll try it. All right, here we go. All right, well, it didn't do too bad. Um, I think where the snow is really packed, it has a hard time with it, but it just depends on the density of the snow, I guess. So I'm gonna go ahead and do the sidewalk. We walk back over there.
right, so this is what it looks like. Wasn't too bad. Could have been worse. You can see the amount of snow right here. See, it pushed a lot of it. So, anyway. All right, well, is. this is what it looks like after it's all done. I didn't do any damage. I did hit some rocks, but this is a this is rubber, real flexible. So it probably flex, and it's a good thing it's not hard plastic. Otherwise, it might have broke. But um, yeah, there's no damage whatsoever after hitting those rocks. So yeah, I'm, I'm happy with it for what it is. I mean, if you got a lot of snow, um, I'd buy something a little stronger. Um, but like I said the way the grass and the grass, the snow was packed, it was hard. It would push the snow and uh, yeah, well, that's it. Um, you have any comments, suggestions? And whether or not you should buy one of these, yeah, I would if you don't have a lot of snow. So that's it.